Hansen. I'm a photographer with the University of Minnesota. I'm based on the St. Paul campus, uh, but I cover all of the university's research and outreach centers, such as the one here at Grand Rapids. And what are you doing here today? I'm hanging an exhibit of posters of University of Minnesota discoveries related to horticulture, agriculture, natural resources. The posters were all created for commodity shows such as the wheat growers or the apple growers and I use them uh, in all kinds of different ways including uh, for this exhibit. <laughs> okay this is fairly unique though uh, co-opting these uh, posters for um, artistic purposes, is it not? Yeah, I kind of decided the whole, the whole public, uh, you know, everyone's entitled to know what the university does, our discoveries and our breeding, and uh, not just the farmers and orchard owners and growers. So I have them, I've had them on display in different galleries and uh, permanent exhibitions in different public buildings around the state of Minnesota. Frostbite apple came, was tested up here in Grand Rapids. It's the hardiest apple in North America, I believe. Is that why it has the name? Yep. <laughs> we had a the university had a naming contest. There's between six and seven thousand entries. And Frostbite obviously is the one one. I was at a conference, a uh, fruit and vegetable growers conference, and it was in the same auditorium or next to it with the uh, food nutritionists from public schools. And they came and approached me and said, they're looking at the strawberries, they're looking at the blueberries, looking at the apples and said, how come these aren't on school cafeterias? Nice. <laughs> Whoever would have thought. So. They are. A lot of them are at least down around the Twin Cities and I'm trying to get a grant to put them in all the schools in Minnesota.